If you see these, run fast and ask for help. There are so many different animals in the world that nobody even knows the exact number of existing species. Some of them are beautiful, and some are ugly. However, not everything is as it seems, because the ugly ones may be safe, and the beautiful ones can be deadly, or not. For example, this caterpillar looks like somebody dropped their wig by accident. It's not very big, but it's very hairy. You might think that, because it's hairy, it's tender to touch. But don't let that fool you. In fact, if you touch the hairs, they will penetrate your skin and sting you. Wow, that doesn't seem fair now, does it? According to the experience of other people, the pain is unimaginably bad. So stay away from this caterpillar if you can. However, if you get stung, doctors recommend washing the area. Use soap and water. But be very careful not to press the spot because this will make the poison spread faster. After you finish washing the sting, put some ice on it to reduce the pain. If the pain doesn't go away within the next 30 minutes or so, go to the hospital immediately. We think caterpillar pus looks too gross to touch it, and we hope you agree with us. Now, we're going to tell you about 12 other animals that you should run from as fast as you can if you ever encounter them in the wild. Counting down from number 12. Death Stalker. Well, the name says it all. This is the deadliest scorpion of all. To give you some perspective, the Death Stalker is responsible for 75% of all victims of scorpion attacks. Usually, it doesn't kill healthy adults, they only feel terrible pain, but it can easily kill children. If they are stung, they have a fever, coma, and finally, they can't breathe because the lungs are filled with fluids. If this kind of scorpion still doesn't seem awful enough to you, how do you like this? They can demonstrate cannibalistic behavior if they can't find other food. They can also eat snakes if they win the fight. The only way to survive being stung by this scorpion is to go to the hospital immediately. <laughs> Isn't this fun? Number 11. Carpet Viper Here comes another champion. Carpet Viper is considered to be the deadliest snake because it kills the biggest number of people yearly. The way it kills is really curious in an awful way. It injects some toxin into the blood of the victim. This toxin doesn't let the blood clot, so the victim just bleeds to death. Number 10. Cone Snail Now, this snail is so dangerous that one drop of its venom is more than enough to end 20 human lives. The worst thing about it is, there is no cure or some kind of antidote. If it stings you, you are dead, whatever you do. It is also known as the cigarette snail, because its poison kills you as fast as it takes you to finish one cigarette. Hopefully, you don't smoke, so that you'll have time for something more important. Number 9. Stonefish This thing looks like a stone, see? Now, there are two things you need to know about this fish. First, if you confuse it with a rock and step on its spikes, it will poison you, and you will lose your leg. That's actually the best-case scenario. The stonefish is very economical. It injects the amount of poison proportional to the pressing weight. The second thing is, it takes the stonefish just 0.15 seconds to react to a moving object, another fish or your leg, to open its mouth and bite it. So losing a leg is really possible. So watch your step whenever you are in the ocean. Number 8. Africanized honeybee. This kind of bee is very different from all others because Africanized honeybees are actually a result of an experiment. Ooh. A Brazilian man was trying to make a new breed of bees and actually let them out. So these bees are more aggressive than regular bees, maybe because they know they were genetically engineered and are pissed off about it. And they can chase their victims for very long distances. Their poison is not more dangerous than the one that normally, more friendly bees have. But if you get stung by a large number of them, you should see a doctor anyway. Number 7. Brazilian Wandering Spider Because they don't have GPS. Do you know why the most venomous spider in the world is called Wandering Spider? The thing is that, unlike other spiders, it is often found in places full of people, especially in the daytime. You can find them in houses or even in cars. 
Now, we wonder how Ron Weasley would react to such news. Number 6. Black Mamba You may have heard about this snake. Its name is pretty popular. Quentin Tarantino gave this codename to the main character in Kill Bill. Now, this snake is known as the most aggressive snake of all. You know, usually experts say that when you see a snake, the best course of action is to move away from the snake as slowly as you can. Otherwise, it might think you are a threat and attack you, which is probably the last thing you want to happen. However, black mamba is very different. It can attack you even without provocation. Some people think that it kind of enjoys it. Anyways, if it bites a person and he or she doesn't get an antidote in the next 30 to 50 minutes, they will die. The poison shuts down the nervous system and paralyzes the victim. Number 5. Poison Dart Frog now, This frog looks beautiful. It's hard to deny that. However, don't let this beauty deceive you. This frog doesn't even need to bite you to poison you. It has poison on its skin. You see, this is how it works in nature. Whatever is the brightest is the most dangerous. Never touch or even come close to something you want to touch in the wild, including the dart frog. Oh, isn't he pretty? Let's just touch it. Oh. See, that doesn't work, does it? Number 4. Tsetse fly This fly is not venomous or anything like that. However, it's still very dangerous. Otherwise, it wouldn't end up on this list. First of all, it sucks blood like a mosquito, which is gross enough as it is. But the worst thing it can do is transmit African sleeping sickness, which kills around 250,000 people every year. Number 3 in our cavalcade of killer critters is the blue-ringed octopus. This octopus is tiny, but as you might have guessed, really deadly. It kills its victims in a very cruel way. It bites the victim and injects a poison into the bloodstream. After that, the victim gets paralyzed within a few minutes, which of course means they can't breathe. The only way to help a person in this case is to start artificial respiration and continue to do it for the next few hours until the effect of the poison wears down. Number 2. Komodo Dragon These guys are really good hunters. They can wait for their prey in a hideout for a long time. After they detect the prey, they chase it, eat out the throat, and wait till the victim bleeds to death. Mmm boy! Most humans are lucky because Komodo Dragons live mostly in places where humans don't, and they don't need to eat very often. Well, that's a good thing. And number 1. The most dangerous varmint out there, according to our list, box jellyfish. This is the most dangerous living thing on Earth, after mosquitoes that transmit malaria, of course. Its venom kills so fast, there is nothing you can do. Just to be safe, avoid all jellyfish that you see while swimming on the ocean or the sea. Boy, it makes you just want to go to the beach now, doesn't it? Anyway. We decided not to tell you what to do if any of the described species attacks you in their own way for only one reason. The only thing you can do is go to the hospital immediately. Even if you don't think that whatever attacked you is dangerous for your health, see a doctor. You know, better safe than sorry. Otherwise, the only surefire way to never meet up with any of these critters is never leave home. Hey, share this video with your friends so that they are also aware of the dangers and won't pet that pretty little caterpillar. Like this video and click subscribe to join us on the Bright Side of Life!